Hello and welcome to the David McClucky DIY channel. I am not David McClucky because he's somewhere else. And today I'm out in the garage doing a very quick job. It's a DIY shelf made only from scrap material that I've got lying around. Very quick and I'll show you how. I just need a shelf so that I can take things like these screws and get them off the floor on the counters and put them on a shelf like that. That's level. Okay, get ready because it's going to be coming thick and fast. This board is going to be the shelf. We're going to have one of these bolted onto the wall and then I'm going to cut a very quick triangle out of this on the wall. This contraption is to help us keep the edges square, basically because we're not savages. You can see how scientific this is. Not at all. One and two. Just use the other one as a template. There we go. Try not to destroy it this time. Whoa, it's hard. It'd be easier if the saw wasn't so blunt. Now we have two. Spooge of glue down one side. Bridge number two. Don't know where my clamps are, so we'll just have to make do. I'm going to use a very small masonry bit to pile up the holes into the wall so that I can get the markings exactly right without having to do a whole bunch of complicated measuring. Then I break out the beast for drilling the real hole. See, this is the kind of stuff that happens when Dave isn't around to tell me not to. Things like using a brush to hold up a shelf while I drill it. I read on the internet that if something looks stupid but it works, it's not stupid. I'm so wise. I'm like Einstein. Looks level enough for me. Got that handy brickwork that shows us where level is. Oh well, well we're going to assume the bricks are level. I'm happy to assume the bricks are level. Glue. More glue. Even more glue. And shelf. There we go. Two shelves in less than 24 hours. Dave, when he sees this, will be proud. Well, maybe. Let us know in the comments section below what you think. Hit like if you enjoyed the video and subscribe if you want to see some more of our questionable DIY skills. Goodbye for now. I should go wash my hands.